All right, here's Owen's training video. I bet you cannot wait to get him back, but I will miss this little guy. All right, so first thing I use, I use white meat chicken a lot, cheese sticks, those sorts of things. As you can see him down here. He's very excited about working because he loves his chicken. So I guess first thing, um, he's on two meals a day. I am just sticking with the dry right now. Um, because it makes him work a lot harder for his treats, as you can see. There we go. Um, so you can do that. Forget about the can, forget about the fresh pet. Doesn't need that, because he's getting all these really good treats. Um, all right, so loose leash walking, he's getting about two hours a day, an hour in the morning, an hour in the evening. Um, he's walked on the left-hand side, as you can see. And I don't give him a lot of leash. His goal is to be walking with me, looking kind of in my direction. Um, he doesn't have to be looking up at me, but he does not allow to sniff or pull or any of those things. Um, I have tried to build in a stop and sit, go away. And um, as you can see, again, he doesn't have very much leash because he makes bad choices when he has the full leash um, off. So we'll start with his loose leash walking. I'll show you what that looks like. Turn it this way. Sorry for all the glare here. He walks on the left side. stop and sit. You don't really have to tell him anything other than let's go. Uh, the sit should be automatic. We worked at jumping up extensively. For me right now, he he did there a couple times, but he has not been jumping up. Oh my gosh, the sun is so bright this way. Here we go. Um, so I practice the off doing these things and he's sitting for treats. his feet leave the floor at all. He doesn't get anything. Hi puppy, 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 puppy. Hi puppy, 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 puppy. Good boy. Good. So doing his jumping up, um, I also like to do one of these, waving things, and that was a big trigger for him before. Waving, sit. So now he has to sit before he gets anything. So off, off, and not jumping up. If he jumps up at you, you can give him a pop with the collar or also lift your knee or both and tell him off. Leave it was another thing we worked on. We started that in class, but I just moved it to the floor. Off, off. So leave it. Leave it, take it. So then we also did the one from the floor today. Wow, well, he's been doing the one from the floor. Leave it, leave it, leave it. Come here, good boy. Leave it, come here, good boy. Oh, good correction for yourself. When you play this game with him, no matter what it is, you can throw a treat on the floor. He never is allowed to have what you use as a distraction. So this piece of chicken gets picked up and we use it to get it some other point in time. So that's leave it from the floor. It should be leave it come here. That's something you can practice leash on. If he goes for the object, you're giving him a little pop and telling him to come here. I'll show you again. So leave it. Leave it. Good boy. The good stuff always comes from you. That was a better lunch. Leave it. Come here. Good boy. Off. Sit. 
Yes. So as you can see, he loves working. He's super, super happy. Um, let's see. We started down stay. This has probably been the hardest thing for him because he has to settle for five seconds. <clears throat> I'm going to show you where we're at with that right now. Right now it's down until I tell you you can get up. You should be on your left. Down. And she scoots around. Down. He's way higher. Down. So that alone took him forever to settle or to settle that long. Here I would. Sit. Down. This is about where we're at. at. It's about where we're at right now. So I'm kind of just pivoting to the front of him. And then I tell him, okay, and he's allowed to move. So I haven't had a stay yet because, as you can see, he popped up once. It's just taken him all he has to concentrate for that amount of time and stay in one spot. He's a busy man, as you know. Come here, buddy. Sit. Down. We play this game a lot because we're just teaching him focus and the ability to stay in one spot for a long period of time. It's nice because it's self-correcting that my foot is hovering on top of this leash. And if he goes to get up, it corrects him and I don't have to. Just this ability, one, to lay down when I ask, but two, to stay in one spot this long is huge for him. So all I do is just kind of stand here and reward him for being there. Okay, good boy. And he gets a treat when he's done. So okay is his release word. And the last thing I really worked on is just kind of making his name positive and coming to his name when he's called. I'm just breaking up some pieces of chicken here. Really having a good response to his name. such an improvement. He's asking, what do you want me to do? He's sitting in front of me instead of jumping and launching himself and biting the leash. Um, so instead of playing this game, I'm just rewarding him for being really good. But all we did with him and, you know, kind of going back to that name recognition game we played the first week um, with puppy school and just kind of reteaching the fact that Owen means calm. This is so huge for him to just be able to sit here like this. Way better. So if you carry around a couple treats at night um, or during the day and just kind of catch him for doing this stuff, you'll start to see behavioral shifts and trends. Um, and again, it's, it's all for the positive. But I would definitely, while he's home with you, keep his little collar on, keep his leash on, let him drag it. And if he starts having problems as far as barking or anything, he hasn't been a really big barker here, um, but jumping up, anything like that, you can catch him and give him a little pop. Don't be afraid that you're hurting him because you'd have to pop him pretty hard with this. Um, he is a big baby, so every now and again he'll squeak. But I'm gonna put this around your arm tomorrow so you can feel what it feels like. It's something I do with all of my clients um, so they can kind of get an idea of the pressure and what it feels like. Um, and on top of it, they have hair. So 
Um, definitely not as abrasive as they look, but I think you're going to find that, um, at least here, he's been a lot more quiet, a lot more um, calm, I guess. He didn't show it tonight in the video, but he was super amped because I didn't feed him yet. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. I'm here to help you. I hope you're pleased with him. I'm super pleased with him. Um, I think of all things, just an attitude adjustment here um, was just the ticket for him. Sit. Sit. Good. And as you can see, he loves to have a job. So he's a super fun dog. We'll talk to you soon.